With 26 seasons, 17 Emmy wins, and 101 nominations, Dancing with the Stars has become one of the most iconic shows on television. This season, we take you backstage and introduce you to the team that helps the stars take one of the hardest journeys of their careers. I should know. I'm season 24 champ, Rashad Jennings, and this is Making of Dancing with the Stars. One, two, three. One, it's not. Dancing with the Stars, it's more than just a TV show. It's really united the world in ways that no one really thought dance can do. The champion of Dancing with the Stars! I'm getting a chance to sit down here with two of the pros. I appreciate y'all joining the show. Take us through a typical work week. On Tuesday, we had no idea what we want to do. We just had the songs. Yeah. And then we came up with a concept together. Then we took that idea to the creative team. They confirmed it. Then we come up with the choreography. Strong, strong, head, head. The fact that every week we have to plant the seed of creative thought. This week, I got a chance to pick a song for Victoria that I think suits her best. We told your story, and this week, I want to tell the story through your parents' eyes. Then there's this entire team that harvested into this incredible tree that grows that then ultimately we sculpt into this incredible performance. And then Tuesday comes around, and you're Start back over. to zero. <laughs> I'm the boss. Do you find the difficulties working with somebody who has zero background versus somebody who has a little bit of background? Sometimes when you have someone who's never danced before, you kind of have to be smart in terms of cover their minuses and bring their pluses and make it look like it's a great show number, but very simple. Erica J. When you have someone with talent, you have the expectation to deliver and it's hard to surprise people. When you have someone with no experience, everything is a celebration. You dancing showed a lot of people that anything is possible. What's the best process for you guys to go about connecting with your partner? You gotta earn your voice. I gotta earn that ability to come up to her and say, yo, this is the dress you're gonna wear. Trust mm -hmm. me. And it happens in those first few weeks when they see how much you care. There's a lot of things she's not doing correctly just yet, but I believe in her because I see that want to do better. You need it, you want anything. No, you're good, you feel good, you feel good. Let's cut that. The shoe, hey. Let's get some better shoes. She's not, you comfortable with right. that? Cool. Yeah. Come here, come here. You're killing it. Breathe. Take it nice and slow. Don't panic. Ultimately, we are everything you need, period, to make you the best version of yourself. Internally, spiritually, physically, you know, and that's why I think You become a best friend, a mentor, psychologist, you become a doctor. Calm down and just do it. Has there ever been a week or a particular dance where it's Monday night, and you're about to perform, and you're nervous for your partner because you don't know how they're about to respond? Every dance. Every <laughs> single every dance. Week. Every, every partner. single partner, yes. When we're standing there, and it's five, four, three, two, go, I'm like, oh, man. You know, we, we're about mm -hmm. to jump off this cliff together. One, two, three, four. I want to dance for you. Dreamcast, if you could put anybody on the show to, to do it, dead or alive, who would you enjoy to see on Dancing with the Stars? By the way, I've been on the show for 14 seasons. All the time, I'm asked the same question. I never have a good answer. Jennifer Lopez for me. I'll come do that trio. All right, <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> show me your ballroom face. Has there been a moment that stood out? I think for me, it was actually come back to Dancing with the Stars. I left for a few years and did, you know, the Russian version and the UK version. And for me, coming back and being part of it again with all my family and friends, that's an incredible moment. This dance made history, and now you have to do the same. Mine easily was when my brother won, actually. Yeah, when he won with Meryl. That's an emotional moment because, you know, I've never really seen him win anything. 
you know, and he's always there for me for life in general, you know, beyond the show, beyond him winning a Mirabal trophy, it was like a great life moment. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. My bad. Nah, man, I love it. Uh, I love it. It's, it's raw. It's just... I... Come on, let's do this. Stop. Come on. Val and Gleb, I appreciate y'all taking the time on making of Dancing with the Stars. Thank you. Representing. Yeah. Uh.